Hey everyone. So I figured I would show you the um, way to enable smart access memory uh, slash resizable bar. Uh, this is for a gigabyte board, but the settings should be similar for whatever you are, whatever board you have, just maybe in a different location. So, um, so the first thing that I did was under, well, I guess under favorites. I don't know where it would be normally, but. Um, is is disable CSM support. So this is going to be, you have to do that the first time that you turn this computer on before you install Windows because it won't let you format into uh, GPT. Uh, it won't let you format a drive into GPT if you have that enabled. And you need that because this needs to be UEFI um, rather than legacy. So then next on the Gigabyte, you're going to you're gonna to go to settings and then it's weirdly in IO ports and you're gonna go and you're gonna click enable resize bar support or auto I should say and then that also auto enables above 4G decoding so that's all you need to do um, in order to get your smart access memory working I wonder if I can add this to favorites there was a way but I don't really remember how um, you shouldn't have to touch this again. For some reason, my my thing just reset. I'm not sure why. Um, it like I was having trouble getting the um, screen to show up for some reason when I was rebooting it, uh, and then it said that F FTPM or something for CPU needs to be reset. I don't, I've never seen that message before, but I also tried to restart the computer about five times just because I couldn't get the screen to pop up, you know, unplugging everything, so maybe it was because of that, um, but I just clicked yes for that, but regardless, that was the BIOS setup, and then if you refer to later on in the video uh, of my PC building video, that's how you get to, that's how you do it during the install, um, like what you need to do in the install to enable smart access memory.